let's get straight into it. So we're going to be making some double chocolate cookies. So you have your mixer, you have your ingredients, what you need to make the double chocolate cookie dough. So now you're going to add your whisk in. Uh, make sure it's in properly and make sure you turn it on so it's working. Thumbs up. Beautiful. Okay. And then you also have your measuring cups. Awesome. Now we start the process of the ingredients. So you're going to add one cup of brown sugar. And then you're going to add three-fourths of a cup of white sugar. Make sure everything's flat and you're doing it properly. Um, and then you're going to add one teaspoon of vanilla. Guys, I'm sorry about the quality. It's not the greatest. It's unclear on the back. Um, you add two eggs. Uh, one and two. Nice, beautiful, stunning. Okay, and then now you're going to add one cup of butter. Then you're going to let it uh, incorporate all the ingredients together. So you're going to incorporate the butter, the eggs, the vanilla, the stuff that you need to let it mix for around two to three minutes. And then you're going to be adding an inseparable two and a half bags of all-purpose flour. Um, two and a half cups, I mean, no bags, two and a half cups. Then you add one teaspoon of baking soda. And then once you add your baking soda, let it mix. I mean, you can mix it with your hand, mix it with your fingers. Um, then you add a half a teaspoon of of salt, excellent, making sure it's half a teaspoon, pouring it in, and then you add double chocolate, the fun part, or the cocoa. It was impossible to take, to uh, scoop it out of the thing, so I just got another one and just put it, dumped it in. Um, and then you see that's how it's supposed to be. It's a little bit chunky, the butter, because it was cold, but it's okay, because it's still gonna come out as a proper cookie. So now you just add everything in and you turn it on and let it mix for about a minute until everything's incorporated and until you have a nice dough, doughy texture that it's it's also sticking to the whisk. That's how you know it's ready. Um, and you let it stop. And you, you, you would know the uh, texture. Um, then you uh, get a scoop, start scooping the cookies into a tray. The big ones usually 50 and the small ones usually 12. In total we probably made about 30, 35. Um, you can probably make more if you want. Um, so yeah, that's the cookie dough that's sitting there. It, it turned the oven to 375 for about 10 minutes and that's where you're supposed to get. Uh, it comes out to, if it comes out to dome, dome shape, all you need to do is just flatten it and you're good. Uh, make sure you wear gloves too when you flatten it. And then in the inside, it's nice and gooey while the outside, it's, it's nice and crispy. So you get a nice crispy outside, gooey inside. Thank you guys. And let me know what you guys think. Comment. Uh, comment down below. Like the video if you guys want me to do another one of these videos. Thank you. And I will hopefully see you guys later on.